Hey YouTube, this is a video on how to fade a colourful image. So we're going to fade it from black and white to its colour. Okay, so we're going to be using Adobe Fireworks CS3 or CS4. So, you're going to need a colourful image. I have my example right here, so I'm going to drag and drop that into the program. And then we have my image. You can download this um, in the description, there will be a link. You can download it from there if you want this image. Okay, now you want to click on, under vectors, you want to click on your rectangle rectangle tool now if you have something else selected like ellipse tool hold down the um hold down the ellipse tool and then click on the one you want so we're going to use rectangle and now make sure your color is set to white solid and then we're going to make um a rectangle uh you're going to start from around here well not around there exactly but you can start from anywhere out of the picture so i'm going to start from here and then you're going to make a rectangle which is around halfway and then let go and then you have white now go under under select click on the mouse and then you want to uh, when it says where it says edge you want to change that to feather Oops, sorry <coughs> and then you want to change that all the way to 100 so it fades nice and well now once that's done we want to go into these uh, you know blend modes here and instead of normal, we're going to look for color. There it is, it's under saturation, color. And there you are. So as you can see, it fades from black and white to the color. And if you get this uh, rectangle we made and drag it, you can actually change the fading of the color. So you're going to fade from about there, about there. You can you move up and down, you know, like that. So once you're happy with it, you can save it. So yeah, that's how you make an image which fades from black and white to its colour. So I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.